first showing I've seen of Microcosm's latest V-Twin. They've had a great success with their V-Twins, starting with the one that I've got, and then going to the mini Harley-Davidson models. But this is a very popular model in uh, model engineering circles and Microcosm has had success with model engineering models before, notably SAM and of course the original um, hit and miss engine. Uh, both of which run really well uh, in the um, slightly smaller versions that Microcosm creates. And this is, a, as I say, it's a famous engine, the Hoglet. Let's have a look at that running. Have a look at what we can see here. Everything's exposed on this engine from the valves to the crank. Uh, there's sort of no crankcase, um, all the gearing uh, and the optical ignition uh, collector there. This is a great idea. The one thing about um, Microcosm's V twins that um, makes me nervous is the fact that they're difficult to take apart to get to any of these parts to lubricate. So I have high hopes that this will be a very easy model to keep uh, lubricated. You guys know I believe in lots and lots of oil on these models because the metals are, of, are usually not as hard as they might be. Um, another, talking of that, another thing you'd notice is um, extensive use of ball bearings and construction, um, not the brass, uh, casting that we've become used to, although the colour of this looks like aluminium to me.